welcome to my channel or my first video ever and I couldn't really think of anything to do so for my first video I thought I would do a review on this charcoal black peel and mask that I just gotten recently because I've always wanted to try them and like I got one at Sally's for like nine bucks so it's from generic value products and it's, it says beauty on it and it says black, charcoal black peel and mask purifying peel off mask infused with charcoal and eucalyptus oil i probably said that wrong leaf oil and it says apply thick even layers even clean dry skin avoid eyes and lip areas do not apply to eyebrows leave on 25 minutes or until completely dry gently peel off max from outer edges friends with warm water to remove any residue so let's get into it so i got my brush and i'm using this elf contour brush that i believe i got at weiss for like three dollars and i haven't i think i only use it like twice it's clean it's from yeah there it is kind of dirty for my makeup in there but whatever so it doesn't matter i'm using the bristles for my face so i'm gonna go grab a napkin and i'll be right back so here's my paper towel, which is I'm gonna be putting it on. So I don't wanna like, I'm gonna like dab it and put it on my face. I was thinking about just putting on a brush for my face. I feel like it'll be better, and I will probably get better results if I just do it this way, having it on something. So I'm going to put a glob on there, start off small, and build myself up, and like definitely looks very sticky. And we'll see how it feels when I put it on my face. So I'm just going to dip my brush into it and put it on my face. Oh, it's cold. It feels very cold. So, like, I'm trying to apply, like, a thick, even layer. I'm starting off, like, from here. Like, from my, like, my right cheek over probably do work then work myself on this side uh, like my left side of my face feels pretty even I believe so I put more on my paper towel because I ran out because I you know didn't think I would run out that fast but I did so now I'm just gonna keep Work my forehead down. So I have my hair like looks like a mess and like in my comfy clothes and didn't want to really like wear anything like too proper because my face has to be clean anyways. And there's like no point in doing makeup or anything. Just put a face mask, take it all off and do a face mask. So that's how it's looking so far. It feels super cold. And put more on my paper towel. So I ran out again. So I'm probably gonna be keep doing this like multiple times. Hopefully like the bottle actually lasts me a bit because like I'm putting a lot on. I just hope I'm putting out too much on. So I'm probably definitely going to put more in this area. So it's been like past 25 minutes because I had to wait to use the bathroom. But so basically like after applying the even layer, like I feel, feel like I didn't get some areas as thick as I wanted to or I should have. Like right here, I feel like it's thin. I'm right, where is it? Right, not right here. Like right here, right here. But we're gonna take it off. It's so hard to talk because it's like so stiff. But here we go.
Oh, I definitely got in some of my hairs. But. Yeah. So, like, I'm not going to lie. Like, it stung a little bit. And, like, I had to actually free, which just come off of water. But. Like. It feels so smooth on my nose. This is where I had like blackheads and everything. And here's what my mask looks like afterwards. And you can definitely tell like it got stuff. Like I'm not sure if you can like see all that. And like I'm pretty sure my nose had a lot. Sort of. Now like if it was my camera would focus. See what it's like on my face. You definitely tell you got a lot of stuff. Yeah, definitely can tell. So I can have to say it work definitely works. And like my skin feels like it's so smooth. And it feels just like I don't know, like I definitely feel something in my hair. I definitely should, you know, like put my baby hairs aside more. I thought like I wasn't gonna get them, but I was wrong. So definitely give it like a nine, like nine out of ten. And the reason why I give it a nine out of ten is because they definitely should have. I don't know. I feel like they should have gotten like a better like a tool with it, like a brush or something instead of like because I feel like maybe the brush I used didn't like grab onto it and it, you know like. I don't know, like, I feel like I was just putting glops on my face. And, like, I noticed there were some bubbles that weren't fully dry. They were just there. And, like, but, in, like, some areas would be, like, perfectly smooth and even. But, like, in the end, like, I really like it. And I'm definitely going to continue buying it. But I might try another brand. Um, I might try, like, mud masks and stuff, too. Because, like, I've never really used face masks. I sell, like, face scrubs and, like, face cleanses, cleansers. But definitely love it. Definitely would go do it again. So, um, let me know what you think down in the comments down below. And so, this is it for my first video. So, like, subscribe, comment, comment more videos that you think I should do. I really hope you guys liked it. Um, you know, comment in the future like, what videos you would like to see and what you'd like to see me do. And I'm probably going to do like a makeup tutorial of like my everyday makeup but or stuff like that but i want stuff that you guys want to see so just let me know in the comments